Yeah, actually, I probably should uh, include those most natural interruptions. And Joseph came and I just feel so self-conscious, so lacking in confidence in some areas. Anyhow, when Andy left, we prayed and read together and spent over an hour talking over breakfast. He was at a gender meeting last night with uh, Gabriela Kubi and Gudrun Kugler, and I was at the Life Plus meeting with Todd Burria. I gave Joseph the signed book from Todd called Leading with Heart, Führen mit Herz. Herz. So now the next decision, what to do with all I've said, with all I've written, should I publish, shouldn't I? It was a fascinating evening with Todd with focus on social media. He invited us to live stream one small section of his meeting after first announcing that no photos or videos were permitted and nothing was to be posted on social media. I was not prepared when he said, now you can film and live stream. I think in the US people do much more of that and he did not anticipate how inexperienced and unprepared we all are for this. I eventually started filming but only just set up the live streaming this morning after breakfast. Now I think I could actually post all that I've written and said. I have to listen to it first to check because I'm so insecure. So insecure but I want to share. I probably should still consider goals and purpose. So why am I blogging was the question that I asked myself. I just want to leave a legacy. And what do I want to leave? I want my grandkids to know who I was. Really? Talking about pubic hair? No, that's for later when they're older, when they're mature, when they grow up. That's to show that I'm open-minded and not prude to reach other people, not just my grandkids. Also, with so much sex trash on the internet, people should be able to come to some substantial content when they serve for such terms and not just all the pornography and junk and trash. I'm offering content that can lead to spiritual growth. Yes, because I'm dealing with overcoming feelings of insecurity and I'm offering content that can lead to spiritual growth and development. Yes, that's my goal. Encouraging people to take a step. I want to be a source of inspiration. I have received so much from the Divine Principle, from Reverend Moon, from Todd Buria. I just want to share it all with you. No, I don't want to convert people to the Unification Church. I don't want you to join the Unification Church. And I do not want to sell any products. I want to share my story, my inspiration, my experience, my wisdom, my love. I want to encourage you to get out there and share your story. And I love listening to people. Tell me your story. Of course, I also love to tell my own story. But I feel like even at 63, I'm still working out my story. You can tell. Look at me. Enough time spent on this. Get on with posting at least the video. But will I really post it without my story? Ungeschminkt. An excursion into the mind of Oz Lily. Summary. I am offering content that can lead to spiritual growth and development. Yes, that is my goal. I want to be a source of inspiration. I have received so much from the Divine Principle, from Reverend Moon, from Todd Burria. I just want to share it all.